everybody, I'm back doing another wash and go. I officially started out my hair with, um, I just co-washed it with this Tresemme, Tresemme Luxurious Moisture, uh, Moisture Rich Conditioner. So, that's what I use for my co-wash. And this is what I'm using for leave-in. My go-to. Must have this every single time I shampoo my hair. I must have it. So, that being said, I'm going to get to it. But I'm going to be real simple. I'm just going to leave my hair like this into two ponytails. But I'm going to go ahead and put my uh, co-wash in. But this is after I have co-washed my hair with the Tresemme conditioner. So, mmm, smells good too. So I'm gonna go ahead and add this much. I'm gonna apply to my hair. And what I really like about this conditioner is it has, you see that? You know where that come from? That right there? Split ends. Split ends. Yes. Yeah, I know where that is. It's the devil. So, um, what I really like about this leave-in condition is that it leave my hair so moist after two, three days. My hair is still moisturized and I really, really like that. Also, you see here I am finger detangling as I'm putting in this co-wash. So, I don't think I did a really good job in that last one that I did for y'all. So, I figured I'd try to get it right this time. And y'all see that right there? Spin ends. I weigh a lot of ponytails and I don't tie my hair up at night which is a big no-no, so don't follow that. If you listening, you watching it, and you trying to get your hair healthy, you must tie your hair up with a silk hair scarf at night. It's a must. You see that? You will have these results if you don't use a, uh, a head scarf at night, at night. So I'm gonna go ahead and twist my hair into two ponytails. This will be my first twist. And I'll show you guys the results after. It's bad because I decided to do my hair kind of late this time. It's, 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 it's late at night. I don't usually do my hair at night. But um, it was time for my hair to be washed. I haven't washed it in a week. Well, shampoo. So it was time for it to be washed. And um, yeah, I'll just show you guys the results. Look at that. I'm gonna show y'all what it the outcome. Let me get it right. Yeah, I'll show y'all the outcome afterwards. I'm gonna go ahead and work this conditioner in. This conditioner is it smells so good too. But this is my natural curl pattern. Some of you are probably wondering how I get my hair curly like this. Just a natural curl pattern. Make sure you get the back. And like I said, my, my ends are horrible. I need my ends clipped. Not just my ends. I probably need about that much clip off my ends. Because if you can see, somebody on YouTube that you like that has the same hair texture as you and follow them and see what they use and find out find out the products they use 
and most likely they'll work for you too. This one got a lot of condition, but that's fine. That is so fine, but you probably wonder, oh my God, you don't use a hair tie? No, y'all, bad, bad, bad thing to do. You must, must go to bed with a hair scarf, you guys. So, uh, here's the back. Stocking. I'm gonna let this dry overnight if I feel like it. Maybe I'll let it sit a couple of days. We'll see. Okay. So I'll show y'all the outcome. Hey, this is the end result of of my hair. I just took it down, put some gel over it. What's wrong with this camera? Yeah, I just took it down, put some gel. So y'all can see what it looks like. The only thing I don't like is that my ends need to be trimmed really, really bad. If y'all can see that. I need to trim my ends. So, yeah. That's the end of the result. I love the curl pattern, of course. But, uh, like I said, I just put gel. I put my, um, my Eagle Styling Gel. Oh, sorry. This is the gel that I use. That's my go-to. Love that gel. Don't use it's no flake, no um, no buildup, no residue. So yeah, this is it. Hope y'all like it. Hey, look, look, I got, I got, I got really bad shrinkage, y'all. If y'all haven't noticed. Yeah. So thanks for watching. Don't forget to subscribe and um, let me know. What could I do about my split ends? Um, and let me know the do's and don'ts. Your do's and don'ts for your hair and your hair um, your hair regimen. Let me know what your you, your do's and don'ts are. I'm on tongue twisted today, but oh well. So don't forget to subscribe. Let me know below what. Um, your do's and don'ts are and what can I do to keep a healthy more healthy hair and these splitting ends away thanks for watching